Hi, my name is Mandy and I change lives and play dress up for a living. It is my goal that these videos will help change your life for the positive, even if it's just a tiny little bit at a time. Today I want to talk about two of my favorite topics together, which are beauty and sustainability. Now of course there's beauty in sustainability, but now I'm trying to find a little bit of a way that you can put some sustainability back into your beauty. First, I want to talk about your unused or barely used beauty products. I think all of us have been to some sort of store or bought something online that is meant for makeup or hair or personal care that I wasn't meaning for that to rhyme, that's pretty ridiculous, but that we thought we would love and then got it home and didn't really care for. Now, some of us may go back to the store and return it, but if you happen to have some of these products at home or even products that you used halfway, as long as it's not something that would be gross to share like mascara, you don't want to share germs, I would recommend donating these to a shelter or charity, potentially for battered women, domestic violence survivors, any sort of trauma survivors, because a lot of times people think about the clothing someone might need or the food that someone might need, but everyone deserves to feel beautiful and confident in their own skin, and a lot of times personal care products and beauty products are things that assist in that, which is part of what makes me passionate about what I do as a makeup artist, making people feel great. So if you have products that are just sitting around not being used, I encourage you to donate them so that people can use them. Now, let's get to your favorite topic, to your favorite products. When those bad boys are empty, do not throw them away. A lot of times they're in elaborate or crazy plastics that are not available for curbside recycling, but that does not mean that they can't find a better home. Most MAC cosmetics users know that MAC has a recycling program where when you collect a certain number of empties, you can trade it in and get a lipstick or lip gloss. If you are loyal to a specific brand, check with them and see if they have a program. If they don't, check out TerraCycle, and the web address is here, because TerraCycle has a beauty products brigade where they collect beauty products to recycle. Not the products themselves, but like I said, the empty containers. So you can look up where someone is collecting them, or I challenge you to do a collection yourself. They get them in July and August, that's when they do the main collection of the items. So if you'd like, you can start collecting early if you have some storage space or an organization that can do it together. And you can actually save up points and use them toward cooler things that you might like a little bit more than an empty personal care item. There's more information, like I said, on the TerraCycle website, which is of course in the caption of the video, but my challenge to you is to give your unused beauty products a new lease on life and new home, and to make sure that your empty containers go to heaven in some way, as opposed to the landfill. Thank you so much for watching. Please share this with anyone that you know that uses beauty products, and as always, have a sparkly day. Bye-bye.